here hosting our third annual Juneteenth celebration, Saturday, June 15th, 1 to 7 p.m. at North Hennepin Community College. Our theme this year is Black Art, Health, and Healing. So we're going to use arts as an expression uh, towards our healing, as well as look at heart or look at art of yesterday, see the presence of art today, and think about what art looks like going forward. Doing art, just putting that paint on canvas together as a family or with friends actually helps people bond and it's fun. It can be a stress reliever. It can just be a way to connect with our community members. It is more important than ever to be able to have an understanding of American history through the Black experience by way of Juneteenth education. So you were getting the education experience. One of the core elements of the Juneteenth experience is celebration. So it's gonna be jovial, it's gonna be celebrative, it's going to be educative, and we're hoping that everybody comes and gets to eat in their various forms of nutrition. But we really want folks in Brooklyn Park and outside of Brooklyn Park too, we want the whole community to come together and just spend quality time together bond. We have to come together as a community if we're going to begin to heal as a community. So it is with great responsibility um, as an African-American black male who happens to work for the city of Brooklyn Park, who also is a resident of Brooklyn Park, has the opportunity to be in collaboration with my colleagues here and Juneteenth planning team, as well as sponsors, as well as the city of Brooklyn Park, to be able to put together this educative experience. It is our responsibility to assure that everybody that steps foot at our Juneteenth celebration leaves with an understanding of what Juneteenth means to this country. And now to recently see the city, city leaders invest in an event like this means a lot to me as a resident because I recognize that they are saying this is important. This is important for us to educate not only the adults, but the young people who live in this city because they need to know about our history so we can learn that, talk about the present right now, and figure out how our future can look so much better and so much brighter as we come together at events like this. Learn more about the connection at ccxmedia.org and follow us on social media.